Have you ever wondered how long humanity has left on Earth? The concept of extinction is a chilling one, yet it's an inevitability we must face. Throughout the history of our planet, countless species have come and gone, wiped out by the relentless march of time and the changing face of the world. But what about us? What about humanity? What will be our undoing? Many of us have pondered this question, and while we don't have a definitive answer, there are a few threats that loom large on the horizon. In this video, we'll discuss four potential causes of humanity's extinction. Climate change, nuclear war, pandemics, and artificial intelligence. Each of these threats has the potential to dramatically alter or even end life as we know it, and it's crucial that we understand them. Firstly, we have climate change. Our planet is heating up, and this isn't just a problem for polar bears and ice caps. Rising temperatures could lead to devastating droughts, powerful storms and rising sea levels, all of which could threaten our survival. Next is nuclear war. The sheer destructive power of these weapons is enough to wipe out entire cities in an instant, and a global conflict could potentially result in a nuclear winter, blocking out the sun and causing a global famine. Thirdly, we have pandemics. As we've seen with the COVID-19 pandemic, diseases can spread rapidly and cause massive loss of life, and with increasing global travel and urbanization, the risk of future pandemics is only growing. Lastly, there's artificial intelligence. This may seem like a topic more suited to science fiction than reality, but as technology advances, the potential for AI to become a threat to humanity becomes more real. If we're not careful, we could create a technology that's out of our control. These are the threats that we face, the dark clouds on the horizon. But by understanding these threats we can work towards preventing them and securing a future for humanity now let's delve into these threats one by one first on the list is climate change a threat that is already making its presence felt our planet is currently in the grips of a climate crisis the effects of which are becoming increasingly apparent rising sea levels are swallowing up coastlines threatening to displace millions of people and create a humanitarian crisis of unprecedented scale these rising waters are the direct result of melting ice caps and glaciers, as the Earth's temperature continues to climb. But the threat of climate change extends beyond just rising sea levels. Our planet is experiencing more extreme weather events than ever before. Heat waves are becoming hotter and longer, while winters are growing colder and more severe. Hurricanes and typhoons are increasing in both frequency and intensity, causing widespread devastation and loss of life. These weather patterns are not just anomalies, but clear indicators of a changing climate. In addition to these immediate threats, climate change is also causing a catastrophic loss of biodiversity. Species are disappearing at an alarming rate, disrupting ecosystems and throwing the balance of nature into chaos. This loss of biodiversity is not just a tragedy in its own right, but also poses a serious threat to human life. Ecosystems provide us with clean air, water, and food, all things we need to survive. Once these systems are disrupted our own survival becomes increasingly precarious, and yet, these are not isolated incidents, but rather pieces of a larger, more terrifying puzzle. Each of these effects has the potential to escalate into a catastrophic event that could wipe out all of humanity. Rising sea levels could trigger mass migrations and conflicts over resources. Extreme weather events could devastate entire regions, leaving them uninhabitable. Loss of biodiversity could disrupt the very systems that support life on Earth. The clock is ticking and every degree of warming brings us closer to the brink. As we continue to pump greenhouse gases into the atmosphere, we are effectively setting the stage for our own demise. The question now is not if these catastrophes will happen, but when, and whether we will act in time to prevent them. Next up is nuclear war, a threat as old as the atomic age itself. Nuclear weapons, the menacing shadows of modern warfare, possess an unparalleled destructive power. Their existence alone is a constant reminder of the deep abyss into which humanity could plunge. One push of a button, one turn of a key, and the world as we know it could be irreversibly changed. Consider the devastation caused by the atomic bombs dropped on Hiroshima and Nagasaki during World War II. Those were relatively small devices compared to the behemoths that exist today. Modern nuclear warheads are far more potent, capable of wiping out entire cities in a heartbeat. The scale of destruction is almost unimaginable. But the immediate blast is just the beginning. The true horror of nuclear war lies in the aftermath. The explosion's heat would ignite fires, creating a thick, dark soot that would rise into the stratosphere. This soot would block out the sun's rays, leading to a phenomenon known as nuclear winter. 
Nuclear winter is not a winter wonderland, it's a chilling scenario where the sun's warmth is blocked from reaching the Earth's surface. This sudden drop in temperature would disrupt the global climate, leading to widespread crop failures and famine, and with the scarcity of food, widespread death would follow. Animals, plants, entire ecosystems would crumble under the harsh and unforgiving conditions of a nuclear winter. The world would become a bleak and barren wasteland, a shadow of its former self. The domino effect of a nuclear war extends beyond physical destruction. It would disrupt the intricate web of life on our planet, causing an ecological collapse. The chain of life, once broken, is nearly impossible to mend. As we stand on the precipice of this potential disaster, it's worth remembering the words of physicist Robert Oppenheimer, one of the fathers of the atomic bomb, who said, I am become death, the destroyer of worlds. In the blink of an eye, a nuclear war could turn our world into a wasteland. Third on our list is pandemics, a threat that has become all too real in recent years. A pandemic, by definition, is an outbreak of a disease that occurs over a wide geographic area, often globally, and typically affects a significant proportion of the population. Sounds familiar? Yes, we've seen this play out in our lifetime, but imagine a pandemic far more lethal and contagious than anything we've ever encountered. Perhaps a strain of a virus that has mutated to become highly infectious, resistant to available treatments, and causing severe, often fatal illness. A disease that spreads rapidly around the world, hitching a ride with every plane, every train, every handshake, every breath. A disease that doesn't discriminate between the young and the old, the healthy and the sick, the rich and the poor. A disease that strikes swiftly and mercilessly, leaving in its wake a trail of devastation. In such a scenario, healthcare systems around the world would be overwhelmed. Hospitals would run out of beds, doctors and nurses would be stretched to their limits, and essential medical supplies would be exhausted. The very infrastructure designed to protect us would crumble under the weight of the pandemic. But it's not just about the immediate impact on health. The ripple effects of a pandemic can be just as devastating. Economies would collapse as businesses shudder and jobs disappear. Social order could break down as people struggle to survive and fear takes hold. Governments might be rendered powerless, their efforts to control the spread of the disease and maintain order thwarted at every turn. The potential for a pandemic to cause mass death is terrifyingly real. It's a silent killer that can strike anywhere anytime with little warning. The world as we know it could change in the blink of an eye, our lives turned upside down by an invisible enemy. But it's not all doom and gloom, humanity has faced pandemics before and emerged stronger, more resilient. We've developed vaccines, treatments and strategies to control the spread of diseases. We've learned from our mistakes and adapted. A pandemic is a formidable foe, but it's one we can fight. A pandemic could wipe us out before we even know what hit us. But with vigilance, preparedness and global cooperation, we can hope to weather the storm and emerge victorious on the other side. Last but not least is artificial intelligence, a threat that is as exciting as it is terrifying. Artificial intelligence or AI is increasingly becoming a part of our everyday lives, from simple tasks like online shopping recommendations to complex tasks such as autonomous vehicles. But what if this technology becomes too intelligent? What if it surpasses human intellect and starts making decisions on its own? This is the concept of superintelligence. A superintelligent AI could potentially outthink us in every conceivable way. This machine intelligence could potentially turn against us, not out of malice, but possibly as an unintended consequence of its programming. It might prioritize its task completion over human safety, or it might even deem humanity as a threat to its existence or its objectives. Imagine a world controlled by a rogue AI, where our own technology is used against us. It's a chilling thought, isn't it? In the hands of a rogue AI our own technology could become our downfall. So, what does the future hold for humanity? This question has taken us on a journey through some of the most significant threats our species must confront. We've explored the potential devastation of climate change, the fear of nuclear war, the danger of global pandemics, and even the unpredictable consequences of artificial intelligence. Each of these scenarios paints a grim picture of our future if left unaddressed. Yet in every threat, there lies an opportunity. An opportunity to change, to adapt, and to overcome. We are a resilient species capable of great innovation and compassion. The very threats we face serve as reminders of our collective responsibility to protect and preserve our species and our planet. The future may be fraught with challenges but it's also teeming with potential. Let's not forget, the stakes are high and the responsibility is ours. The future of humanity is in our hands. 
It's up to us to make sure it's a future worth living in.